Hi. Good morning. It's eight o'clock. It's it's eight o'clock on Saturday. I'm collaborating with an improv troupe. Here they are. This, to make, we're making. Um, what are we making? Blooming envelopes. These are for cutting hair. I brought oh, my own scissors in case. I don't cut. That's for um for that's to kill a small animal. So whenever I'm cutting around a corner like this, like I'm like I'm invading its privacy a little bit. Do you, so, so do you ever teach children? Yeah, I teach children theater. Do you ever think, oh no, this dress is going to be showing off too much for children that are going to well, become adults? Well, whenever I wear a dress ever, I always wear shorts under it. I sit, I sit cross-legged in chairs all the time. I can see my if I go like this. Do you have a boyfriend? Yes. But do you have a cat? Oh. You best be so jealous. For Coltrane, my second cat, is like fending off all the cat gangs of the neighborhood, single podly. This looks just like your head. <laughs> what could this be for? A snowman. I was a huge fan of Rugrats. Oh. Why? They had diapers. <laughs> it was so gross. It was so funny. Yeah, you're not supposed to think about the genitals of babies. I just don't like to have comedy about babies. I also like Legends of the Hidden Temple. Oh my god. Legends of the Hidden Temple, anytime. You could just be wanting to win the game and a uh, as tech. Weller would come out and it would attack you and you would lose. Oh, let's do the lesbian thing with them. <laughs> this is dangerous. Is it? Okay, let's just sort through okay. some of these things. We're to Ew, the side of like dropping. Oh yeah, all over everything in my craft store. <laughs> Ro do you know what the roaches ate all my crayons? They ate your crayon? <laughs> Was their poop color? Ball? Yes, different multicolors. I thought it would be like my new genre art teacher would have liked it. Well, we sorted our papers. I'm going to get out this book. Mark Montano wrote this book. See how it says better on the cover? Bigger, better? No. It's the first one's better. <gasps> Blooming envelopes. Let's talk about the lyrics of that song. That's a song? Some things. The color is so pretty. Thanks. It looks really pretty on this paper. I'm jealous. Well, you can have this one. Okay. Do a jump. The jump. For mine, the ones, but mine were the onion ones. I don't have any brands, so um, I felt like we could sew some buttons. Yeah. There they are. Buttons. You should always have buttons in case um, your elevator breaks and you have to replace the buttons. I'm gonna sew all these pieces together, but not the back one. I'm gonna glue the back one. I don't see that how this piece is useful. And I don't think it will work because I think the whole point is for everything to be able to rotate, but I don't care. The folding part is fun. I wonder if you're supposed to fold it. Let's talk dude stuff. Okay. Because we're doing a lot of girl talk. Like football games. Big cars. Ranches. Tit tits on motorcycles. Like booties. Drinking a beer while looking at a porno. Oh, so no beer. And, it's, and I was thinking about tits, and I got, uh, and I just, and I just, oh, I wanted to death and whack off. I was, I was doing that, too. Owls or the parent? Vote, <laughs> audience. Studio audience, vote. vote. So, when is your show? It's Friday. This Friday, September 28th. What time is it? 9 p.m. It's the debut of Art Camp, the greatest improv troupe ever named Art Camp, and we're going to be giving out crafts, and if you mention this vlog, you'll get one of these really awesome blooming 
envelopes. You can't really use them as envelopes, but you can. You could them. use them as envelopes. Don't say you can't. You Don't can. say I can't. You can use them as an envelope and mail it to your grandmother or your friend Alex.